The water literally looks like poop. This is so disgusting. That's a big fish. That's a big fish. I see some dead fish floating around here. The water looks polluted. Oh, this tunnel is really deep. I don't think this one's alive. No. Yes, we got it. Oh my God, it's moving. Yes. Oh, that is so freaking cool. There it goes. This puddle is literally loaded with fish and they are left to die. It'll eventually dry up. There's a fish in there. Give me my net. I feel fish. Hold on. Look right there. Look right there. That's not good, you guys. Look at that. There's a little turtle down there. Do you want to bite me? Look at that. Oh, there's big fish. Oh my gosh. There's so many fish in here. Oh my God. What is that? What is up, BFB Nation? Welcome back to another awesome video, guys. Today, we're here at one of my favorite spots of all time that is loaded with rare aquarium fish. We've been coming to this spot for a long time, guys, and we've caught some crazy stuff out of here. We've caught massive fire reels, Oscars, rare African cichlids, and a lot more. And well, guys, we came here today searching for these crazy fish. We were gonna play some fish traps, leave them for 24 hours. And well, guys, we just caught here, and it looks like this has actually turned into a rescue mission. If you guys have been watching the channel for a long time, you probably know this spot, and you can probably notice right now, it looks completely different it is literally destroyed right now if you look over here it looks like these people have actually filled in part of the canal they've destroyed the spillway they've gotten rid of some of the tunnels that held all these crazy fish so now guys instead of just catching these fish today we're going to be saving them so right where i'm standing guys actually all used to be water there was a spillway right here and it led to a canal that went this way and as you can see they filled all of this in now like i said guys it looks like they filled in part of the canal however there is still some left if you look right here though the water does not look good they're actually used to be so many fish right here this was the hot spot and that is because all these little hidden tunnels here that held these crazy fish but right now guys it doesn't look good it's not the same as it was since they destroyed this canal it looks like they wiped out most of the fish i see some dead fish floating around here the water looks polluted but i have seen some fish still swimming in here guys so i don't think it's too late to save some fish we got to be urgent though okay these fish do not look good this water is very polluted and i'm just hoping we could still catch some crazy fish out of this hidden tunnel before it's too late and if we come over here to the other side guys this is the main canal and it actually connects that little creek with all the tunnels and before we would never see fish in here but i'm looking at it right now and it appears since they destroyed the little creek all the fish have moved over here i see big placos peacock bass a bunch of cichlids there's literally so many fish in here the most fish i've ever seen so it looks like all the fish have moved over to this canal and i'm really tempted to place a fish trap down here in these rocks there's fish everywhere but you know what guys today is not about catching the fish it's about saving them and the fish in this canal do not need it you know what we might place a fish trap just for the fun of it but today guys we're gonna focus on the other side the side they destroyed and i'm actually looking at it right now it looks like there's a part of the canal that they actually missed and i think there's some fish over there that need to be saved all right guys you can see the canal starts back up right here they filled everything in up until this point but if you look over here there's a little body of water that is secluded and it looks like when they were filling in all this water they missed the spot and hopefully there's no fish in there because if there are we need to save them oh my god what was that there's a fish over there oh my god you guys there's actually fish in here oh this is not good Oh, I'm sick of Oh my god. You guys, right here is like a little puddle of water. This is not rainwater. This was from the canal. And there's still fish in here. This is not good, guys. This will dry up eventually, and all these fish in here would die. This is a big puddle, though. It's going to be very hard to catch all these fish out. And that's what we're going to focus on today. Hopefully, we save a lot of these cool, rare aquarium fish. This really sucks, guys. Another one of my favorite spots destroyed. I don't know what it is, but I guess the people that do this just don't care about the fish. But we do, and that's why we got to save them, guys. Oh, oh my. There goes my boot. Uh, give me my boot back. Oh, God. All right, we'll see you guys when I get my boot back. All right, guys, we're going to start things off here at these hidden tunnels. Because like I said, this was a hot spot for these cool fish. But right now, it's not looking so good. I literally have only seen a couple fish. A lot of them are actually dead, including this thing. There's a dead fish floating around right there. I don't even know what that is. Let me go inspect it. Look at this. What is this fish? I can't tell what it is, but it's definitely dead. You guys, check this out. Oh, my God. This is what I'm talking about, guys. This water is very polluted. And there's a lot. What the heck is this? What am I holding right now? What the heck is that? Guys, comment down below what kind of fish that is. Sadly, it's not... Oh. This smells really bad. Sadly, it's not alive, so we're just gonna set him back down. Oh my god. <laughs> no, my boot. No. Okay, guys, I'm gonna get a net right now. And I'm gonna try and net around in those hidden tunnels. If there's anything alive in here, they're gonna be in there. All right, guys, so now we have a little bucket here for any fish that we could catch, and we have our giant pool net. That way we can reach into this tunnel really far, and hopefully we could pull out some fish. Let's get some water right here. Oh, this stuff is so nasty. 
Oh, this tunnel is really deep. It goes back super far too. Ew, oh my God, look at that. Oh, that's, oh, it smells so gross. All right, nothing in the first net, I don't think. Look at the fish right there. I see a fish, what is that? Oh, it's right there. This spot, guys, has some crazy fish. At least it used to. And hopefully we can catch something crazy today. Oh, there's fish right there. I saw him that time. Please tell me we got him. We got to catch something. In. Oh my God, yes. That's a little African cichlid. Yes, they're still in here, baby. Look at that. Oh, that is so cool, guys. Check it out. This little guy is an African cichlid, a little blue one. It's just a little baby. I think he's alive. Yeah, he's breathing. We're saving you, buddy. Okay, we're going to get him in the bucket. Was there any more? African cichlids are a schooling fish, so when there's one, there's usually more. Oh, yes. Look at that. We got two. Oh my gosh, two Af uh-oh. Oh no, you guys. Is he dead? I don't think this one's alive. No. Oh no, look at that. That one's swimming around. This guy's not. Oh, he's floating. That is not good. This guy is dead, you guys. Some fish are still alive, but some sadly are dead. But we did get one live one. Well, we just caught some fish out of the first tunnel. However, there's another one right behind me. I wonder if I can reach over there. Oh, not quite. <laughs> Oh yeah, usually we would see fish over there. That was a good net. There's just so much stuff in here. We just gotta flop it down. Anyone in here? Right here, Helen, is that a fish? Ew, what is that? Oh my God, look at this, we're on the Oh my God, it's moving, yes! What the heck is that? It looks like a baby gar, maybe. We gotta wash him off. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is a little gar. No way. Yes. Look at that. We got another fish out of here, guys. This one is really cool. This is a little baby gar of some sort. Look at the colors on them. The blues. That is so cool, guys. I thought it was one of the fire reels. We catch a lot of fire reels here, but we've never caught a baby gar. That's so cool. He looks pretty good. He's moving around. There you go, buddy. We're probably gonna get an aerator on these guys. Keep them nice and healthy. Because right now, they're not doing the best. They're in this nasty, polluted water, and they're basically on their last leg so let's keep going guys and see what else we can catch let's get some more nets in the tunnel there i'm seeing fish come up i think they're low on oxygen because i'll see them sitting at the top gasping for air oh right here like this guy oh Helen, that was a water bug oh we got some little fish too that was a good net look at that little mosquito fish you know what guys doesn't matter how big it is or what it is we're gonna save so we're gonna get this guy in the bucket along with this this is a native species this is called a bluegill look at we got the jackpot little mosquito fish okay we're gonna get all these guys and you know what instead of putting them in the bucket i think we're just gonna run them to the other side of the canal there all right here we go guys we got a bunch of little fish we're just gonna toss them in this canal there's so many fish in the rocks right now i'm telling you guys this is where they all went i think we have to place a fish trap here guys so let's get a fish trap bait up and we're gonna drop it down into those rocks all right guys we got some little fish pellets here we're gonna drop into the trap this is the secret sauce we're just gonna drop it down right in these rocks guys i'm seeing so many fish i'm so excited right there that is so so perfect. All right, here we go, guys. We're gonna keep netting. Oh, I feel something big. What is it? Did we get, oh, we did get it. What is that? Oh, uh oh. It's a Mayan cichlid. Never mind. I thought that was like one of the Oscars or something cool. But this right here is a Mayan cichlid. Buddy, what are you doing? Even though it is my least favorite fish of all time, we're gonna save this guy. Little Mayan cichlid. I think that was all in this net, but we'll make sure. Oh, right here. Look at that. Another African cichlid. A lot of these blue ones. Oh my God, he's not moving either. No. Look at that. He's dead, you guys. Oh my gosh. Why is there so many dead African cichlids? That is really not good, guys. This really sucks. Okay, well, we did get a Mayan cichlid. We're gonna throw him in the other side of the Canal, and we're gonna keep going all right buddy there you go into the main canal you guys look at this look at the water this is so disgusting look at the film on top the water literally looks like poop this is so disgusting i see fish in the tunnel i can actually see him right now that's a big fish that's a big fish oh yes that was perfect that was right on him you guys there was a fish gasping forever yes we got it that's an african cichlid for sure look at the colors on it look at those colors the orange the blue a species of african cichlids that's really cool let's get them into the bucket there you go Oh, right there, right there, look. A fish just came up, guys. Oh, right there, come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, we got it. Oh, my God, we got it. I saw it. What is that? He's big. That's like a really big fish, you guys. Check this out. Oh, right there. There's his face. Oh, dude. Oh, my God. No freaking way, you guys. We just caught a clown. It's a little baby clown knife fish. Check this out. Oh, that is so freaking cool. He's so tiny. That right there is a clown knife fish, you guys. That might be a royal one. Look at the patterns on him. That is so cool. Look at the way he moves. Oh, my gosh. He is alive, so we're going to get him into the bucket. We've caught these here before, but I think this is the smallest one. This is so awesome, you guys. Another insane fish out of the spot. They're still in here, guys. So let's get him in the bucket and keep going. That is my favorite fish so far look at that oh wait he has a cataract look at his eye oh that's not good okay we're gonna get him into the bucket he looks good though you know what i just remember guys if you follow this canal down a little bit there's actually a spot that we call the pit and that little pit usually has a lot of really cool stuff 
So I wanna check that out. Hopefully it's still there. Hopefully there's fish in it. And I think we're just gonna set a fish trap and go explore the other spots. So let's get a trap bait up and we're gonna set it right there in the hidden tunnel. And hopefully while it's marinating, we catch a lot of fish and we can save them. Here we go, we got our trap. We're gonna place it right here in the tunnel. There it goes. But for now guys, we're gonna head down the canal a little bit and check out the pit. All right guys, well we're here at the pit or at least what was the pit, as you can see, it looks completely different. It looks like no one's been down there in like a year. Look at that, there's, oh wait, there's a lot of fish down there, you guys, check that out. Well, I guess it's a good thing I brought my pool net because there's no way we could get down there. Oh yeah, come on, tell me we got something. Let's see if we got anything. Let's dump it out, guys. That was a good net. <gasps> yes, what is, oh dude, there's a little playco right here. Look at that guy, a little baby playco. That is awesome. Okay, we're gonna keep this guy. We'll get him in the bucket right there. Did we get anything else? I don't see any sick. Oh, right there. Check that out. Is that an eel? Oh my God. No, it's not. It's a snakehead. A little baby snakehead. Well, that's not what we want to catch. We can't save this guy. This would be very illegal if we were to save a snakehead. They're super invasive here in South Florida, and that's a little baby. We're going to keep the Playco, but sadly for the snakehead, we just got to toss him back. See you, buddy. Let's get back in there, though. There's clearly a lot of fish in there. Ugh. Oh yeah, that was a good net. I wish we could get down there, but it's so sick. Look at this, we got another bluegill, I think. Look at this, we definitely got a bluegill. Yep, there he is, but what is this? Maybe some sort of catfish? Oh yeah, definitely a catfish. What the heck is that? We gotta wash them off. But this guy's a little bluegill. Okay, we got two more in that net. I think it's a sun catfish. It is. Oh, that's a big sun catfish. Look how cool that is, you guys. We've caught these here before as well. We're gonna keep them both. There they go. Oh, what the heck is that? Oh my God, there's something like albino. Oh, I got him. There's an albino fish down there. Oh, yes, we got it. Oh, no, never mind. That's a pink convict cichlid. That's a big one, too. Look at the size of that convict cichlid, you guys. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, my gosh. Look how nasty this stuff is. I think that is it for that net. Oh, never mind. Look right here. There's a little cichlid down here. Oh, yeah, another African cichlid. Look at that. That is so cool. That one's different. Look at the colors. He's got, like, yellow fins, a blue body. But we're going to get him in the bucket right now, and we're going to save him. There they go. Look at this, guys. Look at our haul right now. This is freaking crazy. All right, you guys, we're going to do one more net here in the pit. We haven't been here a long time, but this is literally one of my favorite spots. And then after that, we're going to go explore that crazy puddle where all the fish are trapped. Ugh. Oh, yeah. That was a good scoop, you guys. We didn't get anything. Oh, what the? My God, those are albino. What the heck just happened? I didn't even see them in there. We got two of them. Those are little African cichlids or something. Oh my gosh, they're so beautiful. Oh, that is insane. We got albinos. You guys, this spot is no joke. I mean, those are actually albino African cichlids right there. Well, we're going to get them into the bucket. And now we're going to go check out the other spot and hopefully we can save ourselves some more fish. All right, guys, here we are. We're here at this little portion of the canal that they didn't fill in. They're still fishing here. And what we have is our cast net. Instead of dip netting or fish trapping, we're going to throw this thing around and hopefully cover the entire body of water and hopefully save every fish out of here not the best oh no i'm stuck on something oh no my cast net just ripped the first throw oh my god it's stuck on something else now there's a fish in there i just saw a fish look 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 at the fish there's a fish in there give me my net oh my god oh yes we got it check this out what is it guys we got a fish first throw oh, oh it's a mayan cichlid <laughs> look at that little guy a nice little mayan cichlid all right let's get this guy into the main canal if we just take 10 steps over this way here's another portion of the canal that goes on forever so you should be good in here there you go buddy we'll see you later let's get back in there keep throwing that cast net and see what else we can find all right here we go guys we walk down a little bit we're gonna throw our net again here we go oh my god i suck at throwing this thing hopefully we don't get stuck again oh we're stuck Oh, there we go. I got it. Well, guys, clearly throwing the cast in here was a mistake. Please don't get stuck. Ugh. Oh, I feel fish. Hold on. Look right there. Look right there. What is it? Look at this. Oh, there's two fish. Wait, there's two fish in here. Look at this. What is that? Oh my gosh, you guys, we got some weird cichlid in here. Another mine, but there's something cool. Check them out. Oh my, God, it's a giant severum. Oh, that is so sick, you guys. I don't think I've ever caught one that big. Look at the size of that severum, you guys. Oh my gosh, this is insane. I've caught severums before, but never this big. I think that's a green one. Two more fish out of this little puddle. This puddle is literally loaded with fish and they are left to die. It'll eventually dry up. So we got to try our best to catch all these fish out. All right, there goes our big severum. He's literally the size of my hand. That's so Oh, cool there he goes and the mayan cichlid could go in here with his friend see ya buddy all right let's throw the cast in a few more times to try to catch some more fish all right guys we're here at the corner and it gets really deep right here i'm seeing a lot of fish so hopefully we don't get stuck and hopefully we can catch them here we go pancakes baby that was a perfect throw hopefully we caught some fish oh my god 
I'm stuck again. Oh, I got it. Yes, I got it. We got a fish. Look at this. We got something. Oh my gosh, it's an Oscar. Look at that, you guys. He does not look good, though. It looks like his scales are like peeling off. He doesn't look the best, but he is alive. And that is a big Oscar, guys. That is so cool. That is a giant Oscar. Look at that. You can see right here, it looks like he's got some sort of wound. So that's not good, you guys. Since he's so big, we have a tub in the back of my truck. We're going to run him there. And we might throw him into Pond X later. That is a... Put him back. You're lucky. Stop it. Stop. Stop it. Stop. We're just gonna take it back to the truck, guys. This thing is out of control. All right, there goes the Oscar into this little tub. We'll probably bring him to Pond X later. He is a cool Oscar, but he doesn't have the best colors. So Pond X, he goes. Oh my God, what is that? Look at that, there's a little turtle down there. Oh God, look at, it's a snapping turtle. Look at this, you guys, there's a baby snapping turtle. He's trying to dig right now. Oh my gosh, look what we just caught, you guys. There's a little baby snapping turtle. I've only caught a couple of these guys before. He's so cool. That's just a little baby, guys. This is a common snapping turtle. They're all over Florida, but they're really hard to find. And this right here is a little baby. I guess it's breeding season for these guys. Look how chunky he is. He's literally so fat. Oh, that is so awesome. A little snapping turtle. You want to bite me? He's friendly. He doesn't even want to bite me, guys. That is so cool. Well, since he is a turtle, he's not fully aquatic, so he doesn't need to be saved technically. However, this is going to dry up soon. Maybe they'll fill it in. So to play it safe, I think we're going to relocate this guy to the canal. And that's because we can't keep this guy. They're protected here in Florida, so it would be illegal to take this guy back home. So sadly, we just got to let him go in the canal. I would love to have him as a pet, but we can't. But that is really cool. A little baby snapping turtle. <laughs> oh, he's ready to go. My gosh, these things are strong. Look how big his head is. Oh, look at that. He's so ready to go. His claws are so sharp. Oh my gosh. All right, buddy. You have a good life. This thing is going to become a monster one day. We'll let him go right here. Go on, buddy. See you, little dude. All right. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck again. Come on. Oh, I got it out. Oh my. Helen, I don't think I was stuck. I think it's just a big fish. Check this out. Oh, oh, it's a massive snakehead. Look at that. Holy crap. Look at this, you guys. That thing is huge. Oh, that is insane. I literally thought I was stuck, guys. I thought I was stuck again, but it was just a big snakehead. Oh, that really sucks, though. We can't save them. That would be illegal. So this one right here could actually be the parent of those babies. Look at that fish, guys. That is so cool. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, guys, it sucks we couldn't save the snakehead. However, we did catch some fish out of here, but I feel like there's a lot more. The cast net's definitely not the best way to do this. So I think I'm gonna grab my last fish trap and we're gonna throw it in here. And we're gonna leave it for a few hours and hopefully we catch a lot of fish so we can save them. Because as you can see, this is a big body of water, but it will dry up eventually. So let's get our third and final fish trap baited up and get it into the water. All right, here we go, guys. We got our third and final fish trap. Since this is the last trap, we're just going to dump all the pellets in there. Look at all those pellets, guys. Oh, my gosh. There's better work. Let's zip it up, and we're going to throw it in this corner. Three, two, one. Right there in the middle. But right now, guys, we have three fish traps in the water. What we're going to do, we're going to wait for it to get dark, give it a few hours, and we're going to check all three fish traps, and hopefully we caught a ton of fish, guys. So we'll see you in a few hours when we check our fish traps. All right, you guys, we are back at the hidden tunnel and we're gonna check the trap right now. We have three to check. This is gonna be the first one. I see the rope right down there. So let's see what we caught. Here we go. Got it, sweet. Here we go, let's see what we caught, you guys. I don't see, oh, I feel stuff. I feel fish in here, oh yeah. Oh my gosh, it is loaded. Look at that, we got a lot of bluegills. Oh, this is so good because all the fish we're catching out here, we're actually saving. <gasps> No way, look at that. That's a baby Sevrum. Oh my God, that is so cool, you guys. That's a mini version of that big one that we caught in the other spot. Look at this, we got so many fish. Oh, oh my God, there's another clown in there. Look at that, a bass, bluegill, Sevrum. We're gonna get them in the keeper bucket. There they go. Look at this baby clown. Oh my gosh, this one's bigger than the other one. Oh, that is so sick, you guys. Look at that clown knife fish. What a cool fish. That's the second one we caught today. There he goes. There's a bunch of African cichlids too. Oh, that's so good. Look at this one, this one's so orange oh my gosh look at that cichlid baby blue one orange one we'll get them in the bucket you guys this is literally insane there's so many fish oh big fish oh my dude look at that leaf fish that's a massive leaf fish guys we've caught smaller ones here before but that is a giant one there he goes all right anyone else let's empty it out and oh my god he almost got out look at that oh it's a synodontis that's a big one too look at the size of that guy look at that fin that is so sick look at this little orange one 
and then two of these guys, the blue and yellow ones. Oh, they're so pretty. We haven't caught any adult cichlids today, only babies, which is weird. But I think that is it for the fish trap, guys. First fish trap was definitely a success. We're gonna check the second one now and see what we caught in that one. All right, guys, we're here at the main canal. This is where we dropped our fish trap. There were so many fish in here, we couldn't resist doing that. And if you look down here, our trap is still there. Let's pick it up with the net right here. There we go. Oh my gosh. Look at the amount of fish that we caught in here, you guys. Check this out. The trap is freaking loaded. Look at this, you got, whoa. What the heck? There's so many fish in here. Oh my, I don't even know what to do. Oh my gosh, look at that. We got a little peacock bass. Oh, a giant convict cichlid, some bluegills. What the heck are these? What the? Oh my God, what is that? Look at what we got. We got baby Oscars, African cichlids, and then we got this guy. He kind of looks, well, oh, there he goes. He kind of looks like the see-through fish that we caught in the tunnel that one night that was glowing rainbow. What else we got in here? We got more, oh my God, what? Did you see that? That fish had like a hump on his head. This spot is insane. Oh my God, look at that. Another one of these fish and a baby Severum. All right, we're gonna add them to the bucket. That is so crazy. Oh my God. He's stuck in the net. Ow, ow. That is so cool. That is a giant Raphael catfish. He almost got me there with his little spine. Look at this. I'm just taking handfuls of fish out. More African cichlids, another Severum, and another mystery fish. This thing is so crazy looking, but I think that might be it. Let's dump it out and make sure. Oh no, there's still more fish in here. Oh yes. Oh my God, Helen, look. Baby fire reel. Oh my God. Got him. <laughs> look at that little fire reel. He's adorable. We got more of these mystery fish. Wow, we caught so many of these guys. I knew from the start when I saw the fish in there that we were going to catch a lot. I mean, look how cool these fish are. And yeah, that is it for the second trap, guys. We caught so many fish in there. If you want me to come back, place more traps in here, all you got to do is let me know. But for now, guys, we're going to head to the third and final fish trap and we're going to see what we caught in that one. Here we go. Let's get some water. And hopefully, we caught a lot of fish out of this one because, same as the other spot, every fish we catch we're actually saving here we go got it there's the rope all right we're gonna pull in our trap guys here we go oh oh there's big fish oh my gosh check this out guys we got some big in here it's so heavy oh my gosh what is it what is it oh oh my god do you see that look at what oh my gosh look at this crawfish oh it's a white one i haven't seen a white one in so long come on buddy let go of the rope Look at that, that's a little white crawfish, that's so cool. We'll get him in the bucket. There's some giant fish back here. That's another Oscar, look at this guy. Oh my gosh, look at the size of that Oscar. We'll get him in the bucket. We got plate goes, throw them in the bucket. So many fish. Check this out, you guys. Whoa, what the heck? <gasps> what the, oh my God. I have no idea what this is, guys, check this out. That is so crazy looking, some sort of catfish, I think. Oh my, ow, he's got really sharp spines. You guys, look how crazy that fish is. Comment down below if you know what it is. I have no idea. I've never seen anything like that. That's really cool though. Let's get him in the bucket. That fish is crazy looking. Look at that thing. Oh my gosh. All these fish would have died too if we didn't catch them out. There is some cichlids in here. Look at this. Got a bunch of African cichlids. What the heck? And another big catfish. Look at this guy. Let's just dump out the rest, guys. We, there's a few more fish in here. Look at the, oh my God. Another albino. Look at that. That is so cool, you guys. Oh, you know what? I think this guy is an albino version of this guy look at that they got the same stripes all right the last of the fish we're gonna pick them up right now some bluegills some cichlids we'll get them in the bucket you guys we caught so many fish today out of our three fish traps we saved a lot of them now what we're gonna do guys we're gonna bring them back to my house we're gonna make a stop at pond x though and put these big oscars in there and all the bluegills that we caught and then the rest all the cool stuff we're bringing back to my house guys so we'll see you guys there here we go Look at these Oscars, guys. These are super cool. Look at the red dots on them. Such pretty fish. We already got, oh my God. Okay, he's ready. We already have some breeding in here, so hopefully they breed as well, and we'll have a million baby Oscars. And here comes this one. Here we go. This is the one that has those wounds on him, so hopefully he heals up. See ya, buddy. Wrong way. And the rest, guys, as you could tell, is a bunch of bluegills, some bass, and we're gonna go ahead and get them into Pond X. There they go. All that's left is all the cool stuff. So we'll see you guys back at my house. All right, you guys, we've made it back to my house and we're here at the mystery pond. We got this really weird fish with some hump on his head. I mean, look at that. I've never seen that before. He's almost see-through too, guys. If you know what that is, let me know. And yeah, guys, as you can tell, a lot of the fish that we caught today is a perfect fit for the mystery pond. Baby fire reels, Raphael catfish, Cynodontus, little gar. We caught a lot 
lot of these today. I think like six or seven in total. I don't know what it is, but it's really cool. Look, it's a knife fish of some sort. See him wiggling right there? Look at that. Check it out, guys. There goes all the fish. Look at that. We caught so many today. And that is just the fish that we're adding to this pond. Look at all the guppies that are in here. This is literally insane, guys. Every time I come out here, I'm blown away at how many guppies are breeding in here. And that's why it's a perfect place to put our crawfish. So we got this little white one. We're going to set him down right here. There he goes. And while we're here by the cichlid pond, we have a bunch of cichlids that we caught today. We're going to add them into that pond. Look at that handful right there, guys. We got a big assortment today. They're all about the same size. No adults. So that's really weird. But there goes some into the cichlid pond. Oh, it's so cool. And look at that, guys. We got another handful of African cichlids. We literally caught so many today. That's like the main thing in that canal. So there they go. We got some little albino ones. Now in this bucket, we got a massive green severum. I believe that's what that is. We have a couple in here already, so he's gonna fit in perfectly. There he goes. I don't even know what this is, but he looks like he would be the perfect fit for this pond, guys. Comment down below what it is, help me out. But we're gonna go ahead and add him in. There it goes. Look how cool that fish is, look at him. There he goes, sweet guys. Well, we were planning on just going there today to catch some really cool fish and sadly found out they destroyed everything. So if you want me to go back there and do a part two saving the fish, go down there and leave a like, subscribe down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.